Today, we're in the herd with men's basketball. After a thrilling five-point victory over Loyola in the Patriot League quarterfinals on Thursday night, Coach Nathan Davis's Bison team hosts Boston University in the league semifinals on Sunday afternoon. And he says the first thing he needs to do is to get his team prepared while also resting some players. So we got to get our bodies back fresh and start going over them. But they play multiple defenses with two, three. They're playing more man-to-man -man than been playing. So we might see some of that. So we got to be ready for both of those. And then ball screen defense, they, uh, they're one of the teams in the league that really can spread you out and shoot it. Plus has a post presence with Mahoney and, and, and Souk and those guys inside with Havner. So we got to be able to defend all that and, uh, and make it an untouchable game. He says that he would love to see a great turnout of Bison fans for the semifinals. I think that anytime you have your fans behind you and it's loud and the building's hopping, it gives you a little bit more energy, a little extra hop to your step, a little more focus on what you're doing. So we need uh, 4,000 people in here in orange screaming. Senior tri-captain Donna Folland and his fellow seniors played a lot of minutes on Thursday, but he says that is just what you have to do. This time of year, you just got to go. You just got to keep going, and uh, especially during this last stretch. You can't use the excuse of I'm tired or, you know, play a lot of minutes. You just got to keep going. After losing at home to the Terriers, Bucknell picked up a victory in Boston, and Fallon thinks that he and his team have to use the same formula from the second game. And, you know, we just have to be aggressive and attack gaps and um, look to get open shots. Uh, it's really nothing new. It's basketball, you know, it's a simple, simple game. On, uh, you just got to stay aggressive. And uh, defensively, sharpen up with our rotations. And, uh, it, you know, that was the only way we can make it like it was up there. Tip-off between the Terriers and the Bison is 2 p.m. Sunday at Soika Pavilion.